It's Valley Face 2021, how are we? everyone this weekend it's made me understand that we need like a food revolution the food system is broken and i knew that already but we need complete and utter overhaul young activists are often perceived as trying to be troublemakers or cause mischief but often we're just young people who have this passion for something there's people in government who think they know what young people want but the truth is they don't But we're here to take a stand and we can bring about change if we could deconstruct and consider knowledge in different ways. If you want to shift popular culture so people know how to grow fruit and veg, that is something that you as youth can mobilise and make happen. I'm absolutely sure. There are recommendations here on the disgrace that is food inequality, the disgrace that is children going to bed hungry, the disgrace that is a government that seems not to understand the depths of inequality. And it was young people that made the change that then influenced adults to be like, actually, we need to put our money into things that are going to benefit our children. And you guys have made me realise that if that happened 10 years ago with climate change, that could happen in the next few years with food poverty. It's going to be your work that's going to lead that change. we can make a huge difference. And it's just been great to learn about loads of different issues that I didn't even think were that important. So it's really been a, an eye-opener for me. As a young person, if you want to go out and change the world, if you want to make things better, you do have to push through obstacles and you yeah. do have to persevere and you do have to be tenacious. I just want to say how inspiring this weekend has been for me because everyone is so articulate here and that's how we're going to deliver change. Pass the mic. If someone asks you a question and you don't know, you found someone this weekend that knows the answer to it or that is campaigning on it. So I think working together and ensuring that um, we are being intersectional in our approach is very important. You know, you should always reach for the stars. I believe you should actually reach for the planets that we don't know exist yet because you, if you reach for something that you don't know actually where you're going yet, you will get somewhere because about how you navigate that path. We all have to band together in the future because I do actually think now that a food revolution is possible. Can't wait now to see what we're going to do in the future and see what we can achieve. And I can't wait to go back to my region and start tackling the massive food poverty. I came here this weekend honestly not expecting to see so many young people like me who are also passionate about food. And this weekend has honestly really inspired me to go out and make some change. Go home today, tomorrow and just continue what you're doing because in the next 10 years, 20 years, we are going to be the ones in power and we are going to be the ones to change the system because this is you for food. 